Good morning and hope you all have been well. In today's video, we are going to be continuing on with our Pokemon Xenoverse Let's Play. And this is part 56 of the Let's Play, just to let you guys know. Uh, so yeah, so before we get into the fourth DLC, we are going to be derailing a little bit because Rocket has given me uh, some advice before we get into the next uh, DLC story. So yeah, he has told me that I should get Substitute and get a few more Legends and reteach some moves to a few Pokemon and then hopefully we will be good to go. So we're going to go on ahead and do that for this episode. I don't know if I will get into the main story this episode we'll see what happens but i do want to make sure i am prepared because he did say that once you get there there really isn't any turning back at all but there will be a warning so i know in advance before i go in that um if i want to like back up and go get some stuff before going into it that i can do that so yeah uh, for Substitute, that is one move he did bring up that I should get. I do already have Substitute, so we are good to go on that. I believe he said there was a Legend within the old Team Dimension base. So we're going to go on ahead and check that out as well. Get that captured. And, um... Oh, there's a Shrine there. Well, he said the base, not this. Let me go to the base first. I don't think he would mean that one. If it's not within the base, we'll just go back to the shrine, but I'm pretty sure this is what he meant. Uh, but let's go see what's down here. Get that captured. And then there is a legend he brought up within um, Equinox Village, if I'm not mistaken. So we'll go on ahead and get that guy as well. Now, I don't know what legends we are about to get, though. Um, hopefully, they're going to be decent. I'm sure they are if he's uh, recommending them to me. So, I guess we'll find out once we get to that point. So, let's see here. I don't think I need a repel here. And I think he said something that it would be where we battle Trey. This area? Oh. Bruh? I thought our father owned this guy. Well, let me... Well, first of all, save. Maybe there's multiple? Or maybe it left them? I... I ain't gonna complain. I'll take it. That'll probably most definitely be useful for the one battle then that um they are referring to so let's see here um i'll go for taunt because i don't know what it even has okay miss um just to be safe i don't want to like oko it drain punch okay that's fine now, I should have actually used the Quick Ball first. I did not mean to do that. That's okay. Let me see if I can paralyze. Actually, do I even have Discharge? No, I don't. There's still a chance, but... There we go. I was about to say, there's a chance with, um... How did that Oko? I know we're level 100, but I thought Mewtwo could take a hit. Alright then. I... What I'll do to keep it just simple, I'll pause and I'll see you guys as soon as we get the Mewtwo. So, yeah, uh, give me a moment. Alright, so I just wanted to unpause the video real quick. I am stupid. Um, I guess I must have forgotten that you can only use um, 
I guess the Xeno uh, ball for these kind of Pokemon. I think it's similar to like, um, whatchamacallit, the Ultra Beast. It is doable to capture them in a normal Pokeball, but it's just a lot more lower of a chance to do that, so... Um, I, I guess just in case if people are confused by that, I guess that is a thing. And to be honest, they have probably said it sometime within the game, I just totally forgot about that, so... Uh, yeah, but um... I don't want to attack it because I actually tried it twice with Thunderbolt, and apparently both times it just takes it out instantly. I'm a little bit surprised by that. Maybe it just has, like, low special defense, but I... I have a hard time believing that though, I thought Mewtwo was pretty uh, bulky all around defense and special defense, but maybe this one specifically is different. I don't know, it just feels odd for it to pretty much like Oko it. I mean, to be fair, it is only level 75, I, I gotta keep that in mind, but I don't know why, I feel like it could take a hit, but I guess it doesn't. Or I'm just being stupid, which is probably what it is. Let's see. Okay, so we have that paralyzed. Hopefully that'll help us. And I've kind of noticed you can weaken it, but it it just doesn't really matter to me because it just keeps getting its HP back um, with a Drain Punch. So, I mean, I guess you can bring like a Ghost type. And I probably might do that if I don't catch it soon so yeah but before I just ramble on about dumb stuff uh, let me pause here and I'll see you guys as soon as I capture it so yeah all right so honestly it really wasn't that bad it didn't take many tries at all so I'm pretty uh, happy about that I'm hoping that we have a, a decent nature uh, Mewtwo. Uh, let me add it to the party. Oh, uh, well, I guess I can't send something back. So I guess we'll find out there. And then, I believe... Let's see... That's right, one in Equinox. And I think I remember where that is. I'll probably just have to use Fly to find it, though. But I think I have an idea on where it is. So let's backtrack on out of here. Hopefully I'm going the right way. I think I am. Oh, I forgot to put up the repel. That's okay. So let's see. Well, there is... You know what? I'm not going to worry about that Pokemon right now. It might be good. It probably is, but I'm not going to worry about it. Uh, let me get my... Where's my Repel at? There you are. I will use that. And... That's right. Uh, Pokemon Center. Actually, I don't know why I used to repel here. That's okay. Um, I'm hoping for something decent. Um, okay. Not good or bad. I'm not gonna worry about natures on this guy, honestly. I I'm fine with what it is. I haven't really worried too much about that kind of stuff with this game anyway, so I'm not really gonna start now. Um, let me do this real quick before I do uh, forget. Uh, let me send you back and you as well. Because I think... What? No, I don't want to jump. I don't know what it did. It did something. Uh, let me bring this guy and you. Let's see. 
Wait, where is... I'm dumb. You're right here. What's your item again? Okay. We'll keep that on you, because I think I could swap it out with these two. If I'm not mistaken. So let me uh, reteach you Starburst, because that's what I was told to do. Oh. Do you need the ring in order to do that? That might be a thing. Let me see. Item, take. Let me see. I'm not really sure, but I guess we'll find out. Would it be here? Oops. And I gotta mute Discord soon. Sorry. How do I find... Here it is. We'll give... You the ring. Let me see if that does anything. No. Okay. So then, where do I... Sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to look it up right now. Uh, Xenoverse Starburst because it's not here No, not the candy um, Let me type in Pokemon Well, I know about Mount Starburst, but I don't know. Is it because like it's only level 70 it can't learn it? That doesn't seem right though. Um, what's the Pokemon's name? Shu Long, I think. Let me see. Xenoverse. What's your move set by level up? Is there a Musa? There's gotta be one, right? No. By leveling. Is there another item? see there's this what this doing I mean I'll find out I'm sorry for kind of like dragging this on um Well, this move set seems a little different. Maybe I'm just going crazy. Probably am. But isn't there a like a third evolution? What's the third one? Like, how do you? Let me look here. That's the. Okay, no utility. Um. No, it wouldn't be 
there, wouldn't be there, not there. Um. Let me do this. Xenoverse, star burst, move. Because all it shows is Mount Starburst. Yeah, I'm, I, I'll just stop there before I drag this on. I, I already have for far too long. Um, I, I clearly have forgotten how to do that, so I'm, I'm not going to worry about that right now. Uh, let me get that. This guy here as well. Um... I'll actually at least um, change up Mewtwo's moveset here and then we'll head on over to Equinox. Uh, let me see what I can uh, teach you. I... Honestly, I, I want to run a special set if I'm going to be honest. Um, Horse Fear's not bad. Nasty Plot ain't either. I, I kind of want to try Sub. The cover might not be bad actually. I'm gonna at least teach it that over mist. I don't need mist at all. That can go. Running a physical set may not be bad, but I prefer special. Well actually let me let me see its stats again. Empathy one no I want special. Uh, do I have, like, flamethrower, ice beam, and stuff like that? I know I have ice beam. Let me see. Yep. Oh, whoops, wrong button. I definitely want ice beam. And I want flamethrower. For good coverage. And then I guess I'll keep, um, Psy Strike. And then I might get rid of Recover for Sub. We'll see. And do I have, um... I do want Flamethrower. Fire Blast would do more, but I prefer Flamethrower for accuracy. Because I don't want to keep missing moves 24-7 when it matters. So let me uh, get rid of uh, Power Punch. And I think we're going to go with that for now. Um, if the one viewer uh, rocket, if you remember how to get the move Starburst, please let me know. Actually, real quick, it's called Starburst, right? <laughs> I want to see, am I going crazy? I'm pretty sure it's called Starburst. Oh, wrong button. Yeah, Starburst, okay. Gotcha. But yeah, I forgot where... Actually... Is Starburst... Now I'm kind of remembering this. Do you get it by where you capture the Pokemon? Before I actually, like, derail any further than I have already, um... Let me go to Equinox. I don't know why, but I kind of remember that, though. So, um... Yeah, let me just stop there. Uh, Equinox was, um... Somewhere. Here we go. Let's see, Legend and Equinox. Maybe down here? Oh, that's right. I also... I forgot. I, I also wanted to get the, um... I don't really care about that item. Whatever it is. 
Um, I wanted to go back to the base and get the Tyranitar um, X to change the forms because that might that might be something useful I, I don't know but I did want to go back to get that oh that just leads well I'm already over here So then... Not there. Is this just... Yeah, that's just taking me back. Maybe this way? somewhere up this way I kind of wonder what it is though because I will say I wasn't expecting the Mewtwo to be honest I don't want to, like, be spoiled by what this is, either. So let me push that down. Go down here. I have no clue what that is. But I'll take it. Uh, yes, I would. I will say, going through this though, another thing that's kind of um, been on my mind is um, the one Delilah battle. Even though it took me about, I want to say like, oh, well, what are you doing here? <laughs> was not expecting you. I'll take it. Um, but what was what was I about to say? That's right, the Delilah battle. Um, as I'm trying to catch this guy up, kind of like bring it up. It's kind of crazy because, um, that battle was definitely more on the difficult side. It took me about, I want to say like an hour and a half to find my own strategy for it. Of course, with the help of Rocket. And again, thank you so much for telling me about Taunt. Um, that, that's something that I have to agree with. That I don't think you can go about that without even using Taunt on the, um, the Toxapex, you know? Maybe there is some other strategy, and, th and that's what I wanted to get into. Oh, Sticky Key, sorry. Um, I don't know what I was doing there, holding that down. But, um, that's something that's, um, been on my mind that, um, I've looked into, like, a few other strategies, and it's so unique that, um, that there's, like, so many different ways to go about that battle. I think it's just really cool overall that um, everybody has their own way and strategy. And that's also one thing that I love about Pokemon. Because like, with my idea, I'm like, is there many other ideas to go about this? And apparently, yeah, there actually are. So I just found that really cool overall, that there are just plenty of ideas to go about those battles. Of course, by no means, um, would I say like I'm like an expert at all with any of that kind of stuff? I I would say like I, I know what I'm doing, but I'm definitely not like a god at Pokemon either, if that's fair to say. But I don't know. It took me a lot longer than I wanted to, but we got through it, and I'm really happy with that. And I'm also kind of excited to hear that this one actually might be more wild than the Delilah one. Even though that battle I was getting into I was miserable at the end, like, alright, I want to be done with this. Um, but I don't know. Definitely not a bad thing either. I was really happy to see the difficulty, even though I sounded miserable. It just kind of reminded me of, like, intense mode, no items with uh, rejuvenation. Even though it sucks going through those kind of battles, there's just something rewarding afterwards, like, it's like... You did it. This absurd, crazy battle, you did it. 
you got through it, you know? Just something cool about that. I gotta be careful because I don't want to burn it. And then it like dies to burn before um, I capture it. Let me start the low cut. I will go into Lugia. Now, I forgot what typing this guy is, honestly. What just happened? Was it at two shields? I, I must have missed it. I thought it was at the final one there. Maybe not. Uh, let me max revive the, um, oh, uh, somebody. Okay. And then I will do that again. I just want to keep the team healthy, honestly. I'm hoping this guy doesn't take too many tries. Uh, let me recover. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. That's okay. I'm fine with that too. I also don't want it running out of, like, uh, PP at all. I guess I could low kick. Low kick did do a lot, though, but I, I can't imagine this would kill it, right? No, it doesn't. Alright, I'm not... I... I don't want to be risky with that at all. I'm just going to start throwing some Pokeballs at it. Not weak enough. Alright. Um. Uh, I don't want to burn it. I don't know, Greninja? Let me see what the what this does. It shouldn't do a lot. No. I'll go for one more and I I can't imagine it would need to be weakened anymore. Like it's in the red. Let me see. Okay, cool. I was about to say... I was about to say, that would have been nice if we got it there. Um... Hello? I think it had ancient power, actually, but that's okay. Keep getting kind of close. Oh, hold up. So I got a text. I mean, I can, keep, I can keep looking at it. Right, I'm dead here. I 
go into probably I mean you should be fine. I was worried about that. That's the thing that's gonna make this really tricky. That it's like, I, I guess right off the bat, I just should lead with the um, Electaburst and just keep going for uh, low kick to like till I get it like low enough and then um, go about it like that. So uh, let me redo that and I'll probably just unpause until I capture it. So yeah. All right. Sorry for the pause there and. Sorry for not unpausing sooner, uh, but we did get ourselves the one legend, so yeah. I think what I'll do though is I'm just gonna end the video off here, and um, yeah. I I kind of thought about it more with the X Tyranitar. I do plan to get it, probably just off uh, video though. I don't think anybody really wants to watch me go back down there to do all of that, so... Yeah, I'll get that off cam, and um, if somebody does want to let me know about the starburst to the other starters, that would be greatly appreciated. Also, I probably need to look into it as well. I think there's like a third form for the starters. I don't remember how you're able to do that though, so that's something I'll need to look up, but if somebody wants to let me know, that would be appreciated, so... Yeah, but I think with that, that'll be it. That will be it, sorry, for today's episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Definitely do appreciate it. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Good morning.